Hey guys, welcome back to my English channel. Today I'm gonna be talking about my favorites of the 2016 products I've been loving through the year and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be loving on 2017. I'm gonna be talking about skincare products, accessories, books, uh, healthy products that I drink and use to feel better. So I hope you guys are ready and let's start it. I'm gonna start talking about skincare products. Uh, I, the other day, I was in QVC, not the other day, but a couple months ago, I was in QVC watching something, I never got to QVC, I don't know where I went that day, but I saw these products from Josie Moran, it was a package that they came, the foundation, the pure argan oil, and the pure argan milk, something like that, I used to have the bottle, but I finished the other product, and I'm definitely gonna get it, but I love this when I apply it every single night. I dab it in my fingers and I do like massage. And what it does this is moisture. It's a moisturizing oil and hydrates your skin. I have a really really dry skin, so I definitely need some products that help me to hydrate my skin. And this one is one of my favorites in 2016, together with the Argan Milk. Another product I've been loving also is my Mary Badusco Skincare Facial Spray. It has oil, herbs, and rose water. I just apply this before and after my makeup and it really helped me to hydrate my skin and make it look much radiant, glowy, and better. Uh, this one also, I am looking for the mask that I used together with this, but I don't know where I put it. But it's, the, it's from Fresh. And it's the Soy Face Cleanser. And it's super gentle. And this is what I like about My skin is really sensitive. So any product I use, it gets like a rash or get pimples. So I have to be really careful what I use or choose to use on my face. So I use the Fresh Soy Face Cleanser and also the Soy Face Mask that I don't find. But I would definitely, one of my favorites of the year. Uh, moving on to, fa to uh, makeup, I'm going to talk about... My favorite primer and it's the Hourglass. I started using this when I did makeup for my wedding day. The person used this primer and I just love the texture. It's so smooth. And when you apply it to your face, um, and then you apply your foundation, you can see a flawless skin. So I definitely recommend this if you're looking for a smooth skin uh, and if you want the foundation look flawless. Talking about foundation, I have two foundations. I have one from my everyday makeup and one from my, my everyday makeup and one when I go out. One from my everyday makeup is my Miracle Cushion from Lancome. I like this one because it's easy application. You don't waste product. You just go like this and apply it. I usually do my makeup in the car every morning because I wake up late and I don't have time to do my makeup. Uh, and it also has like a like a it has a good coverage, but it's really sheer. So it's good for everyday makeup when you want to wear some makeup but you want to look like you're not wearing makeup, this is the perfect one. And then if you want something more, more coverage but also hydrating, moisturizing on your skin and not like give you like cracky face that I hate, um, I would definitely use this one. It's the Steel Lauder uh, Double Wear Nude and it's also a cushion stick. It has like this cushion that, I, oops, just fall. Uh, and you just apply, it's perfect. It has a nice coverage, it's the one I'm using today. And I just love, 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 love this. This is my first Steel Lauder um, product and I definitely recommend you. Per favorite of 2016. Uh, talking about, let's talk about um, uh, oh, bronzers. Um, this one is not a bronzer, but I use it as a bronzer. And this is my MAC Harmony Blush. And I like this one because it's super natural in your skin. It gives you just that glowy effect in your skin. It doesn't give you like deep, harsh lines in your, uh, in your cheeks that I don't like. I just want to look like a little bit of color that's perfect for that. And it has the perfect color as well. I also uh, contour my nose with this. And the other one I love is my Laura Mercier. And the color is brown 03. This one is more orangey, so I apply on top of my Harmony, and it gives you like a, like that sun kiss bronze that everybody wants. Perfect, I love it. Uh, moving on to highlighter. Highlighters I love are my Laura Geller uh, big um, big highlighter French Vanilla. I love that for my under um, under eyes. It gives me that pop and that brightness and that highlight that everybody wants to have under the eyes. 
this is the one you're looking for. I went to Ulta and I said, girl, I need something like that. And she said, you have to use this since that day. I'm using it every single day. Uh, so next, let's move to concealer because concealer is super important. I also have an everyday concealer and a concealer I use for a more um, for a makeup that more to go out. My everyday concealer, I would say, is my MAC Pre-Prime. Super easy to apply. Since I told you guys, I do my makeup on the car. This is like boom, 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 and I'm ready to go. And it's super light, and I love it. It's the one I'm using today, actually. So, yeah, I love my MAC Pre-Prime. And for some uh, looks that need more, like, um, for, like, you're going to take a picture and you want, like, look more flawless and, like, no, nothing of dark circles, I will wear this one, and this is the NARS. Radiant Cream and Concealer. I love this one. Love it for a couple years and I keep loving it. Uh, you guys can see it's almost gone. So I have to get a new one. I miss you. Uh, but yes, if you need more coverage, I would definitely recommend this NARS. So now moving on to eyeliner. And the eyeliner, I have just only one and only one only and only one, only one only. <laughs> it's my Lancome Art Liner. Uh, if you are a person who is hard, it's hard for you to um, the, do the winky eye, I would definitely recommend this because it has that easy applicator. It's like a pencil, you're just doing like art in your face. Uh, it's super black and the la one thing I love about this, it doesn't get like shiny. It, when it dries out, it dries out matte, which I love about this. Since we're talking about eyes, we're going to talk about our primer. And the primer I'm in using in every single makeup you guys can see in every single video I have is my Urban Decay Eye Primer Potion in color Eden. Uh, I don't change it. I love it. And um, yeah, just Urban Decay. Love it. Let's move on to eyeshadows. And the eyeshadows I'm loving are two. Are my Carly Vivel by VH Cosmetics. I'm going to show you inside. I love the highlighters, especially this one right here is the one that highlight my nose sometimes. And I love the colors. It has like three matte colors and then shimmery to create a little bit more like a for a night out a look or for a summer look. I would definitely recommend this. But the one I love, 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 love. <laughs> I just got this palette to be honest with you, but I just love because the colors are amazing. Most of the colors are matte. It's like two shimmery colors. And I love this one because it goes perfect for dark color eyes like me. It makes it pop, it makes it look the color nicer. I don't know how to explain. But that's my Mother Renaissance Anasti Anast from Anastasia. Anastasia, see, sí, because I am Latina. Yes, yeah, si se pronuncia. That's the way you pronounce. Um, I don't know if in English you say Anastasia, but I say Anastasia. Uh, but that's the colors. There's just amazing quality pigmentation. Moving on to blush and highlighter. The blush that I'm loving is from my palette, uh, Jackie Hill. I'm, it's hard for me to open this because I, one of my highlighters broke. But it's the one right here. Okay, guys? Don't worry about that. Don't look at that. Don't look at that. But this color. So it's like it's like a goldish pink color. And it's just gorgeous. I, like, I just love this color. It's like a goldish pink color. Uh, the highlighters I love are... This one right here for my everyday makeup, it's my WhatsApp from Benefit, and it's like this, it's like a stick. I have, with this one I highlight my nose, and right here, if you guys can see, I highlight with this one. I like it because it gives you that uh, highlight, like natural highlight that you want, and uh, it doesn't over powder. Um, so I sometimes I use just this in mascara and of course my eyebrows, and I look like a natural glowy. And another one of my favorites is my uh, Champ and Pop from Becca. Uh, Jackie Hill is this color. It's like a uh, champagne, but it's more like um, rosy undertone. Like definitely love this one more for looks at nighttime. Talk about lip liners. How I can forget about lips? How I can forget about lips? So the the things I've been loving for lips are these products right here. They're four and pretty much the same. <laughs> So my favorite lip liner and the one it cost me like a lot to get, it was my 1993 from Urban Decay. It's a nude color and it's perfect. And another one that I love is the one from Lancome and the color is um, Sheer Natural and also it's like 
nude color they're pretty similar and the lipstick i cannot live without and i will die if i don't have it is my velvet teddy from mac uh i just love this lipstick and i need to have it on my vanity on my purse or whatever i go with me i love this lipstick it's the perfect nude and yes velvet teddy is the best for me and also another one and the one i'm using today is from gerard cosmetics and it's the sheer and it's like a like it looks like a lip gloss but it's a lipstick liquid lipstick and the thing about this lipstick that i love is like dry out matte so no shiny matte i just like matte things i don't like shiny things that much uh, another thing that i'm using to hydrate my lips and i use it every day because this type of the season is really it really it makes my lips look bad it's my rose bound to to hydrate my lips and that's pretty much about makeup moving on to health uh, two things my greens from it works it can alkalinize my body detox my body and also give me the energy i need to go through the day and my probiotics to help me to my digestive system and my immune system i think i drink one pill every morning and i definitely need to have this um now moving on to accessories guys my favorite accessory of 2016 is the choker because it makes you look edgy and stylish and make you i don't know i just love it i like to look a little bit edgy i just love chokers this is just one of my collection i just want to show you what i'm loving another accessory i'm loving are sunglasses and i'm gonna show you three pairs i'm loving this this year uh one of this one is the white it's this is the i never get this one this is my first one from this brand but it's the wild fox and this one give you like um it's like a simple black sunglasses and it's like my first square sunglasses it just give me like that look like perf like a glamorous look of course this is not glamorous at all but yeah oh yeah perfect so glamorous christina another one i'm loving that i just got it is this raven and it has like a velvet i don't know if you can see like i have a velvet um texture in the frame i uh, just love raven and i love this type of um sunglasses so yeah definitely one of my favorites and the last one but not less are my Prada sunglasses that of course my husband gave it to me that I love and I cannot live without I love I love 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 the the details on this they're so different so yes and this black purse I mean I got it from Christmas last year and my husband gave it to me I love the quill in the front it is from Mishka it's from Mishka, Black with Mishka, and I love it because it's super versatile. You can put a lot of things on, um, and this one that is just amazing, unique. It has the it's all uh, sequence, and it has the word love, and it has a little like light bulb there. So different, it can make a statement in your outfit, and I love accessories that make a statement in your outfit. Favorite of 2016, and I'm for sure I'm gonna be using it in 2017. And for last. I'm gonna talk about one of the favorite things I got this year and it has changed my life or the way I see it. It's this book that my dear friend uh, gave it to me. It's called You're a Badass. So this book tells me, uh, it's been telling me, do what you love because you are the person who's gonna be stuck with that. And what really my heart says is this channel is my baby and this is what I really enjoy. I enjoy doing this for you guys, talking to you guys, reading your comments, creating content for you. It makes me happy. It's like not a job. It's something that gives me satisfaction. This is what I wanna do. That's why really this book is telling me and I love it, love it. I, it makes me look my life in a different perspective and it makes me get the negative things change it to positive things so if you are into the personal development i would definitely recommend this book that's it uh pretty much that's my favorites of the 2016 and i'm pretty sure i'll be using it in 2017 i hope you guys have a wonderful new year's uh that all your intentions become a reality remember work hard for them go for them don't listen to other what other people has to tell you Listen what your heart is telling you, what your brain is telling you, what your inner is telling you. Take a, a leap of faith and go for it. Take a chance because you never know what's going to happen. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. Happy 2017, guys. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Leave me your comments below. Tell me what you want to watch next. And always remember, be confident, be beautiful, be yourself. I'll see you next time. Bye, guys. the 
the vision of your pure, your, your pores, pure, uh, pores, 